it's Mally and welcome back to my channel. Okay guys, so today I just have some quick motivation for you. So if you guys know me, I might have mentioned this in one of my videos before, but the two sports I did last year was volleyball and track. And actually I'm going to be talking a little bit about my track season. And I really learned like a lot about just like motivation from track season. And that's kind of a weird thing to say. But one of the things that I really struggled with was I ran the mile and the two mile. So in those, you have to balance out how much you're going to use your energy when and where. So you really want to get like a good place whenever you start, but you really want to finish strong and you want to hold your pace at a very good capacity and have enough room to go push yourself forward to pass up people in the race against you. And so it's pretty much just a lot of a mind game and you're just really pushing your body every time you get on that track. So it is a lot to think about. And one of the things I really struggled with is I would get scared that I would waste too much of my energy so I wouldn't push myself hard enough. So one of the things my coach and my dad always said to me throughout the whole season was don't leave anything on the track. And that is such great motivation, especially for track, but it's also great motivation for in your real life. So that's kind of what I want to be talking about you guys today. So everyone needs to, everyone has their gift, right? God has given you the specific gift so that you can go out and accomplish what he set out for you to do in this world, okay? So one of the things that I always compare it to, and I say this a lot on my channel, is whenever you're in the army, they give you special weapons so that you can go and do what you're supposed to do. So God has given us these gifts so that we can go and accomplish what he set out for us to do. So that's kind of what I like to think of it as. But one of the things that I heard my dad say once was, don't let your gifts just die with you. Use your gifts so much in your life because God has given you the, those gifts that you can go out and accomplish your destiny, right? So don't just die with those gifts, like be using those gifts. Use those gifts so much. Because God didn't just give you these gifts just for you to have. He gave you those gifts that you could go out and accomplish something. So that kind of relates back to what I was saying about track. Don't leave anything on the track. Don't leave anything on this earth. So I just really encourage you guys today to don't leave anything on this earth. Give it your all. Go out there and do what you're meant to do. So with that being said, if you're a teenager like me, let me just tell you, 1 Timothy 4.12, 12, 12 says don't let people despise you because you're young and I love that verse because I personally have done a lot when I was younger and so it's always been kind of a struggle because a lot of teenagers my age they're not doing what I go out and do so I just want to encourage you start using your gifts now like don't let anyone despise you just because you're young like you can go out and you can start changing the world me um I have a successful YouTube channel I um I've written a book and I'm working on another book. I have just done a lot of accomplishments in my life and I didn't, I lived by that verse, don't let um, anyone despise you because of your youth. And that's how I've been able to go out and do that. So I just encourage you guys, don't leave your gift out on the track. Start when you're young like me. Start your ministry or whatever God has called you to do right now and go all the way for the rest of your days. So that is just a little bit of encouragement for you guys today. I encourage you guys to go check out my other motivational videos and I will see you guys next time. But before we leave, make sure that you comment down below if you like this video and make sure that you follow me on Pinterest and Instagram. You can check out all that in the description box down below and you can also buy my book. So I'll see you guys later.